and anything that I say in this video. If it's triggering to you, please click off for this video. I don't want to be triggering or hurting anyone in any way, shape, or form. Hi guys. Today I received some shocking news. I actually found it scrolling through my social media and come to find out Landon Clifford from the YouTube channel Cam and Fam uh, had committed suicide. He committed suicide on August 13th. It was a shock, you know, he had been going through depression for a while now and he started abusing his medications and just not really asking for help and you know trying to do this on his own and he just he had had enough and so he went into the garage and he he killed himself I'm not gonna say how because I know that that can be triggering um, and anything that I say in this video, if it's triggering to you, please click off for this video. I don't want to be triggering or hurting anyone in any way, shape, or form. So, be mindful when you're watching this. And, you know, with me struggling with depression and suicide and self-harm and... It's real, you know? Check on your friends. Check on your family members. Give someone a phone call, you know, asking how they're doing and just, just check up on people, you know. If you haven't heard from your friend in a week, give her a call or go out to lunch or do something, you know, just check on your friends and family, you know, because you don't know if they're hurting, you know. I, I know with me, I was concealing it for a very, very, very long time to the point where I had attempted suicide. And, you know, I survived. I, I'm alive. I'm here today. And, you know, I'm starting to feel better, you know, with my depression and anxiety. And I'm just having an open line of communication, you know, with my family and with my friends. And that's what you need to do is have an open line of communication with the people you love, the people you know, so that if you do need help, they are going to be there with you. So I wanted to make this little video. Um honoring Landon Clifford. He was 19 years old and he left his wife, his two beautiful girls, his family, his friends. You know, he he let the depression and suicidal thoughts get the best of him. So if you're struggling, ask for help. Even go to the hospital and be like, hey, I need medications. You know, I'm feeling suicidal. You know, I feel like hurting myself. You know, they will take care of you. Whether it's the hospital or your family or your friends, don't be scared to ask for help. I know I was and look what happened. I had attempted suicide and I had, you know, cut myself many times. And so, you know, I just want to spread awareness, you know, that people do suffer with depression and mental illness, anxiety, ADHD, everything. You know, there's people out there who are struggling and you need to pray for them, keep tabs on them, if you know what I mean. But, you know, I just wanted to come on here and say, Landon, I know you're in a better place now. Uh, there's hundreds of thousands of people who are missing you and will be watching over your family, making sure that they're okay. And we're sorry that this happened and my condolences to Cameron, you know, his wife, who now has to take care of two two girls. You know, she's been through a lot because she was the one that found him. And she's just going to be traumatized for the rest of her life, seeing him there. So my point is, check on your friends. Have an open line of communication. And don't be afraid to ask for help.